right, we've dried things out across the entire area. Going to head into a pretty cold night ahead. Nice and warm out here. The sun shining and we got a whole crowd. 72 degrees at 8 o'clock this morning. We're still going to deal with the fog right into the 8 o'clock hour. Pretty powerful storm system right now, and this will eventually be tracking from west to east. The entire state going to go under this winter weather advisory as we head on into your Tuesday. For the downtown skyline, the Indians are playing right now at Progressive Field. You've got a mostly sunny sky. Here. Just over the last two, three minutes, the freezing rain has picked up. The green color there indicating a few showers starting to arrive. Sandusky right down towards Mansfield will be widespread four to eight inches from Sandusky to Cleveland to Akron down towards Canton. Now it will be south of Canton where we have some warmer air in place and that's where you'll get one to four inches of sleet with the groundhog soft. Potentially some small hail in that icon. So let's see if we can put a track. Raindrops falling right now. Uh, if you take a look at the light behind me, you can see the icicles that have formed. Greg, and you're right, about 14, 15 years, this will be the coldest air of the season. On Moscow, you're looking for a little bit of snow. Now, the bulk of the accumulating snow for Moscow will be later this evening into tomorrow afternoon, where 6 to 12 centimeters will accumulate, and that's going to bring more significant snow accumulations than yesterday's snowstorm. Still hours away, and we'll be covering it all day long. From Wrightsville Beach, North Carolina, I'm Jason Hanman for AccuWeather. Keep in mind, that around this time of year, the average low temperature is about 19 degrees, and that's where we'll head down to. And we're still hanging on to the cloud cover here, but there's a lot of dry air in future view. The darker red color right there in Mansfield along 71, heading up towards Ashland, indicating some heavier downpours. You can see all the lightning strikes associated with this storm system. Now, the red color here, that's where it's just pouring out there. So well, uh, flooding definitely a concern as we move throughout the rest of this week. See, there is some drier air that will work its way in. And so tomorrow, your Saturday, partly cloudy, a nicer day, 56 degrees. Oh, we are feeling the heat out there. It's actually nice if you stand pretty close to the lakeshore. Into a nice, fresh coating out here on all of the paved surfaces. We've had cars come through. We'll start to get that fog lifting right around 10 o'clock this morning. Live at Cedar Point's brand new ride, Gatekeeper, coming up next. I'll be riding this. Just going to get a little breakfast in first.